Good morning. Happy Vlogmas. Today is December 6th. It's Monday morning. I am <gasps> so tired. Um, I got up this morning like, do I have to? Do I? Yes, of course. I have to. We have to work so we can pay bills. You know that good stuff. Um, I spent last night editing Friday's Vlogmas from when I went to the party and there was a live band at the party and they were jamming, okay? Um, so as I'm editing, I keep replaying the music and now the song is stuck in my head. Thank you very much. Um, <laughs> the name of the band is Cool Caribbean Vibes and they are Trinidadian and Trinbagonian. When I say Trinbagonian, it means Trinidad and Tobago. So uh, it's that full, uh, th that group of people and they live in the States and they've come together and they created this band and they play all genres of music and the music was just fun and i had a good time and i was dancing and everything you know exactly what you're supposed to do at a party so um yeah but now the song is stuck in my head so i'm gonna have to call the the one of the ladies in the band <laughs> and be like look at what you done did <laughs> but um yeah so i was up doing that last night and i kind of got carried away so of course it was late and then i went to bed late and you know, you know the drill. So today we are trying to focus on just help, help um, working on getting the house ready for Christmas. So we're gonna start clearing things out. We're gonna try to get the tree up from the basement and get it all together and get it get it put on. So put up, I should say, not put on, put up. So, um, and I'm gonna try to figure out what I wanna do with the dinner table. I wanna, if I wanna do a new design or not, We'll see what we have. So that's just basically it for now. That's in the plans. So if anything else pops up, I will let you know. I'm about to have breakfast because I'm starving and I need coffee or tea or something. I need something. So yeah, I'm going to go do that now. So take care. See you later. So I finally was able to get my breakfast together. I did not have time to go to the bakery yesterday like I wanted to. So I got some Pillsbury biscuits and you know what? It's going to do the trick. I also have spinach eggs with cheese and turkey bacon and that is breakfast. I'm starving. Hey everyone. So work is done and I have a few things that have just fallen into my lap of what are we going to do today? <laughs> Actually, so... um. I work with Caitlin, AKA Wanderlust Knitter. She is the designer for The Lamb and Kid, um, who is run by Sarah Diamond. They're out in Bainbridge, Washington. They have a whole big store out there and they have exclusive patterns. So since I'm a graphic designer, what I do is they send me the images, they send me the words, I put it together, make it all pretty, we go back and forth, we proofread, and boom, we have a pattern. So um, my job starts tonight <laughs> for the next pattern. Um, I can't really tell you exactly what it is yet because um, it's top secret. <laughs> so, uh, but look out for the Lamb and Kid. They will be posting some patterns probably later on this week. When I have permission to let you know what's going on, I'll definitely let you know what's going on. But what I can do is I can feature something that I worked on before. They have a pattern called the Cozy Cuffs pattern. And it's basically cuffs for your hands. And it's an easy, easy, easy knit. And when I was at Woolen Folk uh, during Rhinebeck weekend, they had kits available. So um, I bought one. And I actually bought two. I bought another one for my mom. So this is going to be her second project. So once she gets the cowl down, she's going to need to have mitts to match. So I will, you know, ask you if you're interested, check them out. Check out their patterns. Check out their yarn. Oh my God, the cashmere that they have is like... I don't even want to say butter because butter is not soft enough. You know how they say things are soft like butter. It's like whipped buttercream meringue floaty caramel. I don't know how to. It's just so like, it's just so soft. Like it's the softest yarn I've ever, ever, ever knit with. And like I've knit with a lot of yarn. <laughs> so 
I would know, trust me. But um, definitely check them out. Check out the Lamb and the Kid, the Lamb and Kid, sorry. Check out the Lamb and Kid .com and check out all their stuff. Every day they're having like, if you check on their Instagram, they're having, you know, every week is like a different thing. And then they've got like, they dye like new colorways every so often. And then they'll have like, make your own this sweater or make your own cowl or make your own like different things like that. And then they will put together a customized kit for you, which is really awesome. So um, definitely check them out. So I have to work right now. And, you know, aside from work, I have to work. Um, but this is my fun work. And hopefully I'll get it done really quickly and send it off to them. And pretty soon there will be a new pattern that they'll have available. And once that is done, my intent <laughs> is to watch the boy band Christmas, some boy band Christmas show going on tonight. Because like Boyz II Men is going to be on there, New Edition and some other bands. I can't remember off the top of my head. I just saw it like really quickly on the TV, but it looks interesting. You guys know I love music. So that's going to be what I watch when I get my knitting in tonight. So let me go and get the graphic design stuff done and then I can show you my knitting. Oh, but before I do that, I wanna show you what came in the mail today cause I'm excited. So the first box that I'm opening is from Sprinkle Pop Shop. And I ordered sprinkles for Christmas, <laughs> for Christmas cupcakes. So these are just, you know, your normal red and green. And we have like little evergreen leaves. And are those evergreen leaves or holly leaves? Whatever they are. You know, red and green. Here we go. And <laughs> then I also got some red and gold. And we have like the bells because that's what we have, Christmas bells. And um, these bells are actually made of wafer paper. These are so cute. Like this is going to look so nice on uh, a cupcake. And I also got another one another christmas one this is uh looks like little candy canes are in here look at that rockefeller christmas sprinkle mix so these are little candy canes and red and silver and what else did i get oh i got orange because my mom's favorite color is orange and i know i'm going to um it, oh this was a mystery so this was a mystery and um they sent my mom's favorite color they must have known something was going on um, maybe I might need to call up Gigi when I make these cupcakes and we can have a little party. Hello. <laughs> so, um, another thing that I ordered is, uh, Royal Icing Santa hats. So I'm going to open it up and show you what it looks like. Give me one sec. Okay. So one of them jumped out of the casing, but it's okay. So it's really, really really cute um come on get into the light and he wants to run but yeah <laughs> so this is a little santa hat made out of royal icing and it's so adorable so that can go on top of the cupcakes and i think it will look really nice with this color and it i think you know it'll also look nice with this color as well so we're going to see, you know, as the holiday season extends itself, we'll see, you know, who's lucky enough to get one of these cupcakes. <laughs> so I'm going to add all of these to my sprinkle collection. Oh, I have one more to show you. So now I have a collection of Christmas sprinkles. This is another one that I bought. It is called... Oh, snow cute sprinkle mix and you might not be able to see it but there's a snowman hiding in here somewhere oh there he is and there's another one there as well so what I love about these sprinkles is you get the variety of colors you get metallics and you also get like these little characters like there's little little um, snowflakes and there's snowmen and then we've got you know the the bells here and you know, it's just, and little candy canes. So it's just so cute. It adds just a little extra touch of niceness to your holiday treats. So I am so excited. I cannot wait to make cupcakes now. And um, I have a friend who has a, a, a nonprofit that she works with and they do a lot of giveaways for kids. 
during the holidays. They did one for Halloween and I did some cupcakes for them. And she calls me and she goes, I'm going to need you to work with me again to do this. And I'm like, for Christmas. And I'm like, okay, no problem. So I am all geared up. So when she calls me, we're going to have these cupcakes. We're going to have a whole cupcake arm on this counter. And I cannot wait just to put smiles on these little kids' faces. It's going to be so much fun. So this is it. <laughs> Second box, we got some goodies from Bath and Body Works. They had a Cyber Monday sale and everything was 40% off. So, I mean, come on, I had to, I had to. So, uh, snowflakes and champagne, sorry. <laughs> snowflakes and cashmere, duh. I got it confused with champagne toast, that's what it is. So I got snowflakes, snowflakes and champagne, shout. Why do I keep saying that? Shamika, you can read, you know. You went to school. Okay, let's try this again. Snowflakes and cashmere, because we love cashmere, especially in the yarny world. Snow, snowflakes and cashmere. Shower gel. And we've got snowflakes and cashmere body butter. Glotion body butter. It has little sparkly bits in it. And speaking of sparkle, why not? Snowflakes and Cashmere Diamond Shimmer Mist. This smells so good. And my other favorite scent, Champagne Toast. So I got a Shea Butter Cleansing Bar. And we also got a Moisturizing Body Wash Champagne Toast. Because you know winter is really harsh on your skin. So I have no excuse. I will not be ashy this Christmas or before Christmas or even after Christmas. This whole winter, I am covered like this box right here is everything. So I am super happy with my shipment. I did order a few more things. So this is one box of many. I, get, I think I got two boxes coming. So um, there will be more as time goes by. So here we go. So I wanna take a moment to really give you a look at what comes in the Cozy Cuffs kit from the Lamb and Kid. So the yarn is called Diamond Lane and it is Percy. It's DK Sport Weight, 100% cashmere. Hello. <laughs> this is so soft and beautiful. And we also have two colors came in this particular kit and it's like an orangey red and a pink. And yeah. This is it. So these, the, well, the way the pattern is, you can use your minis if you want to, um, or you can you can you can keep it solid, or you can add a color pop stripe, and the pattern will explain to you where um, you need to start adding in your color pop if you want to. So this one is called Pop Rocks, and yes, it does look like Pop Rocks for real. And this one is Fondue Party. So. These colors are beautiful. Um, this one is Fog from Diamond Lane. And um, yeah, this is going to be a really nice, quick knit. Something if you plan on, you know, getting someone a gift at the last minute, this is something you could do pretty quickly. And the pattern is very easy. I already read through the pattern because I had to graphic design it. So I had to look through all of the text. And as I'm reading it, I'm like, oh, this is easy to make. Yeah, it, it it's very straightforward and you will have a pair of mitts in no time. So if you're interested in some cozy cuffs, you check out the Lamb and Kid. You can buy a kit online and they ship it to you immediately. Like, they're so good. So, uh, yeah, check it out. Hey, so it is after midnight. <laughs> I've been working on this uh, pattern uh, for the past couple of hours. Um, I did stop to go and watch the, what was it? A, a boy band Christmas or something like that. It was actually pretty interesting. Some jokes were good. Some were kind of like, uh, you know, <laughs> staged. But um, the singing was impeccable. Like, I can't, like, mm. so, uh, you know. I just love it so uh yeah so i i did that and um i watched a little bit of the voice and i didn't see who who got booted off so wait i don't think anyone gets booted off today i think it's tomorrow so you know there's no devastating news at the moment <laughs> but um 
I was working on that pattern and I sent a text to the designer and I was like, you guys are going to be doing kits for this, right? She's like, yeah. I'm like, good, because I want one. I'm putting in my order right now. Like, it's not even published yet and I want I want it. It is a beautiful pattern. I wish I could tell you more, but I I, I cannot until it drops. But it is a beautiful pattern and it's just squishy and lovely. That's all I can say. And um I am just trying to figure out what pair of sneakers is gonna go matching this uh thing that I'm gonna make here. Um and um yeah it's gonna be it's gonna be awesome so i i think i can i can foresee me getting that done hopefully by the new year um if everything goes well um so yeah as soon as they're ready with um kits i will uh place an order and i will let you guys know what's going on with the lamb and kid and this beautiful pattern that i just um edited um <laughs> Let me add, if you are a beginner, this pattern is beginner friendly, okay? Um, I, you know, I just had to look at all of the text, all of the instructions and, you know, proofread and make sure everything's spelled right and all that good stuff and the spacing looks good and blah, 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 blah. And I just kind of like knitted in my head, <laughs> if that makes any sense. Because like I just envisioned, okay, so you do this and then you do that and then you do this and then you do this, and, you know. Um, so yes, beginners, definitely, this is a pattern for you. Um, yeah, and it's one of those patterns where you can be as, you know, contrived with your colors as you want or you can go crazy, you know, or you could just do one color or not. <laughs> so, um, okay, that's it. I'm not going to talk about it anymore because I don't want to give anything away that I'm not supposed to, but just keep a lookout for the lamb and kid pattern coming out pretty soon. I don't know exactly when, but it will be before Christmas. I guarantee it. Well, I'm not guaranteeing anything actually, but they're, they're, I'm working hard so that it can get done earlier than Christmas. Let's put it that way. So I'm doing my part. So if everybody does their part, which I know they will, um, that might be actually on my needles by Christmas, I'm hoping. Um, yeah. So now that I have gotten the work part of my day squared away, let me work on showing you the advent calendar where I'm at right now. And then um, I'm going to have to call it a night because I'm starting to get these bags under these eyes and we don't like that. <laughs> also, you see I'm wearing my specs. Um, yeah, I've been getting a lot of, um, my eyes have just been, you know, just, it's probably the blue light or the computer or actually I, I did set up an appointment to go and get my eyes checked. Uh, it's going to be next Monday. So, you know, it happens, you know, you get older. And, you know, we are in this time frame where we are staring at the computer screen way more than any of our parents or grandparents because they didn't have it to look at. Okay, so this is like a whole new thing for us. So every, everyone in our age bracket um, is having issues with eyes. And I've, I've been noticing that. And I... Um, I used to have 2020 vision. Um, I think I still do, or maybe it just went down a little bit, but I, I don't know. We'll find out. Um, but it's getting to the point where if I don't have enough light in the vicinity, then I then everything starts to look a little blurry. So um, it has to be this light, this computer light thing. It, it just has to be. So these are blue blockers, and they have minimum magnification in it because I don't really need a lot, but. Hopefully I won't, um, hopefully I'll just get pretty frames and, you know, maybe hopefully possibly my, uh, site hasn't gotten worse, but we'll find out. Um, either way, it's okay. There's technology that helps fix things and, um, yeah, I'll just see what happens. If, if that, if that happens, then I'll just get a new pair of glasses and it's fine. Um, 
Yeah, and you know we got to get it done before the end of the year. So December is the time. So I'm going to go and get it done. So yeah. All right, it is. Uh, this video is going way too long. It's going to take forever to upload. So let me stop it and um, show you the advent calendar stuff. Okay, so I made some progress on my socks from the Cozy Knitter Advent Calendar. I got to the third stripe, and this color is like, is it purple? Is it gray? We don't know. It's somewhere in between. So, um, yeah, so this is this is my sock. It's a pair of socks, I should say. So it's getting, slowly but surely, it's getting there. Hopefully tomorrow I can do more than one row. <laughs> For day six, we have botanical yarn, and I love botanical yarn. Can I just say that right now? Um, I have bought two of her mini skein sets, and I just love them. So I'm excited to see what color we have in here now. <laughs> okay, so we have this light purple color. Uh, this lavender color. Um, it's a tonal. There's a few little speckles, but nothing too much. It doesn't say the name, so I'm I don't know, <laughs> but it's cute and it uh, it's gonna go well with all the rest of the yarns. I'm going to have to find a pattern to put them all together because. They all within this purple blue color scheme and I'm, I'm digging it. So yeah, botanical yarn. So the day is drawing to a close. I'm going to sleep now. And um, I think I have three videos to actually edit tomorrow. Um, I wanted to do editing today, but I had to get that pattern out for uh, the Lamb and Kid. And I'm super happy that I did it because I am so excited <laughs> to start um, planning my colors for this pattern. Okay, I'm not going to say anything else because I keep teasing you. So sorry. Not sorry. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm going to call it a night and um, put some eye cream on because, ugh. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Have a good night. Happy Vlogmas.